So there are two types of crops. So crops that are grown in winter are called as the Rabi crops and they are grown from November to April and they do not depend on the monsoon rains. Example is your wheat and legumes. So crops that are grown in winter are termed as Rabi crops and crops that are grown in summer are called Karif crops and these crops are grown from June to October and they depend largely on the monsoon rains. Example is your rice and maize. Next we are going to talk about the different stages of agriculture. So earlier we have we seen that winter crops are called Rabi crops. Crops that grow in winter are known as your Rabi crops. And crops that are grown in summer are known as your carif crops. So crops that are grown in winter are known as rabi crops and crops that are grown in summer are known as your carif crops. Moving on to the different stages of agriculture. So the various stages of crop production are given below. So we are going to see the different steps in agriculture. So the first is your ploughing. So the field is ploughed. So the field is ploughed that is it is getting ready for the crops to be sown. That is soil is loosened using plough. Either it is done by using animals like your cows or it is done by machines or any other uh, scientific advancements. So the, uh, the soil is loosened using a plough to let air get into the soil and to remove stones, pebbles etc. So normally if you take a hand of sand you will find small pebbles or stones in it so well while doing ploughing all this is removed to remove stones pebbles etc before the seeds are sown so the first part first stage in crop production that is in agriculture is your ploughing so we see the field is ploughed that is it is the soil is loosened using a plough to let the air get into the soil and to remove stones, pebbles etc. before the seeds are sown. So this is your first stage. Moving on to the next stage we enrichment of soil. So manure that is cow dung and fertilizers like your urea, superphosphate Ammonium sulfate and nitrate are added to enrich the soil. Like normally for us to get energy when we are tired, we take in some energy drinks or we eat food that gives us energy. In the same way for a plant to grow well, the soil is fed with manure like your cow dung and fertilizers like urea superphosphate, ammonium sulfate and nitrate are added to enrich the soil. So we were talking about the different stages of agriculture. So the first is the ploughing. So here the field is ploughed that is the soil is loosened using a plough to let air get into the soil and to remove the stones and pebbles that are found in the soil before the seeds are sown. Next is the enrichment of the soil. So manure that is cow dung and fertilizers like urea, sulfur, sulfur superphosphate, ammonium sulfate and nitrate are added to enrich the soil. The next stage in your agriculture is your sowing. So once the, the field, the land is ploughed, 
and the extra stones are all removed then the soil is enriched with manure and fertilizers and next stage is the sowing here healthy seeds are sown sufficient spaces are left in between the seeds so that they get the warmth air and water as required by them to grow so the third stage is your sowing here healthy seeds are sown and there is sufficient space left between the seeds so that they get warmth air and water as required by them to grow the next stage is your irrigation so once the seeds once the land is plowed and the soil is enriched then the seeds are sown next comes the irrigation here the crops are irrigated that is water is supplied to the fields through pipes and channels so that crops get sufficient water for growth so the next stage after sowing is your irrigation so irrigation is the process of supplying water for the crops to grow so the crops are irrigated that is water is supplied to the fields through pipes and channels so that crops get sufficient water for growth so first is the plowing then comes the enrichment of the soil then sowing of seeds next is irrigation the next stage is the use of chemicals so the next stage is your use of chemicals so the crops are sprayed with chemicals which are called pesticides and the purpose of spraying these pesticides is to protect them from pests like your mice farmers place scarecrow scarecrow is a type of um, a, a kind of statue uh, in the form of a human which is made with cloth or other raw material and they place these scarecrows in fields to frighten away the birds so when you look at a scarecrow it looks like a person standing there so what happens when the crows or the birds see these scarecrows they think it is a person standing so they don't come near the crops the fields are also fenced to protect them from grazing animals like the cows and goats that graze around and they enter into the fields and they destroy the plants so to protect the plants from the grazing animals they fence the entire area so next is your use of chemicals so the crops are sprayed with chemicals called pesticides to protect the them from pests like your mice and the farmers place scarecrows in fields to frighten away the birds the fields are also fenced to protect them from grazing animals the next is your harvest and storage so the next stage is your harvest and storage the crops are harvested that is they are cut and gathered when ripe so once the crops ripen they are cut and they are gathered so the crops are harvested that is they are cut and gathered when ripe so talking about the different stages of agriculture the first stage is your plowing here the field is plowed that is the soil is loosened so that air gets into the soil and to remove the stones and pebbles before seeds are sown the next stage is your enrichment of soil that is many or cow dung and fertilizers that is urea superphosphate ammonium sulfate and nitrate are added to enrich the soil so the first stage is your plowing the second stage is your enrichment of soil the third stage is your sowing your healthy seeds are sown and sufficient space is left between the seeds so that they get the warm air and water that is needed for them to grow 
the next stage is your irrigation here the crops are irrigated that is water is supplied to the fields through pipes and channels so that the crops get sufficient water for growth so the next stage is the use of chemicals that is the crops are sprayed with chemicals called pesticides to protect them from pests like your mice and the farmers they place scarecrows in fields to frighten away the birds the fields are also fenced to protect them from grazing animals the next stage is your harvest and storage the crops are then harvested that is they are cut and gathered when ripe so these are the different stages of agriculture so the first stage is your plowing then is the enrichment of soil sowing irrigation use of chemicals and harvest and storage so these are the different stages of agriculture